Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Meghan Markle and actor Simon Rex. If you remember back a year ago, I did a video about Simon Rex and what he said about dating Meghan Markle. That was the rumor that was going around that he dated Meghan Markle. So what he did a year ago was to set the record straight and to say that he's never dated Meghan Markle. That basically they were set up for a date and uh, they ended up going out for lunch or dinner. I think it was uh, dinner and it went fine. It was like he was seeing a friend. It was not romantic. At the end, when they parted ways, they were happy with each other. They were like good friends and nothing at all happened. And he added that he was offered $70,000 to lie about Meghan Markle and say that they did had a one night stand. He refused to do that. He said that at the time he needed the money. He's an actor. He's quite famous. We know who he is and we know what movies he was in. But he needed the money because he hadn't worked in some times. And he said no out of respect out of the fact that you can't lie on something this big about a lady especially someone that was supposed to get married so now he's come back on it during a podcast he was asked what happened and all the details about that story he said that after voicing his concern about the way the tabloids were treating Megan and after giving details about his story of, about of being offered money to lie, he said that Megan Marco wrote him a letter, letter saying that she's so moved and touched that he chose to do the right thing instead of lying. She wrote in her letter that it's good to know that there are still good people out there, people that are not going to compromise their own principles for money. So he said that she was sweet in her letter and that he kept that letter framed somewhere in his house and that is one of his uh, most prized and precious possession. So yeah, this is what we've been telling people for so long, that the tabloids are lying. One, they can't find anything they invent and they pay people to, to see lies about Meghan Markle. This is a prime example of that. And I can tell you that they did the same with all the entourage of Meghan Markle on the Markle side. I'm talking about Yvonne, a.k.a. Samantha Grant slash Markle, or her father, Thomas Markle, or the rest of the family, Markle family, who are profiting off Meghan Markle's back, making money and complaining that she's harassing them when she's never said a word about them. Anyway, just to say that this man is a gentleman. He's a good person. He's not a sellout. He's never wanted to say something terrible about someone that he's only met once and hasn't seen since. This is how men should behave, not like that piece Morgan, who met Megan once, had lunch in a pub once, texted twice, and he thinks that she owes him something. Anywho, let me know what you think. Hope you like the video. Feel free to click on like if it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Thank you.